Ya está grabando. Hello YouTube, this is my bug out bag. I'm gonna make this real fast because it's a lot of stuff. Okay. I have my jacket. It's a Gore-Tex parka. Waterproof sneak uh, boots. This is a duffel bag. I have an extra bag in case I need to carry something else. I know this is kind of extreme, but I also have a gas mask. You never know what might happen. You might need to put on a gas mask. Or this is a actually nuclear biological or chemical gas mask. I have a camel back. It has a lot of things in here. It has earplugs, a knife, purification tablets with filter, MRE heaters, uh, face masks. You have bath towelettes in case you need to take a clean yourself up. Inside here, I have about 40, uh, 50 emergency mainstay drinking water pouches for when you're on the go. In this bag, I have the food, which is basically consists of a whole bunch of MREs. I have one, two, three, four, five, six MREs in here in a bag to hold it. In this bag, I basically have my clothing, which uh, is very important when it's when it gets real cold. You know, for morale, you don't want to stay wet. You want to try to stay as dry as possible. I have rain gear. Matching uh, trousers for the Gore-Tex parka. Some, some pants. Some black shirts. Socks. Underwear. Uh, little beanie, scullies. Uh, gloves and belt. And you need some really good leather gloves. Also inside of the duffel bag, I have overalls, cause you never know. You wanna stay, like I said, dry and warm. In this bag, I have a lot of things. I have binoculars, it's very important when you wanna see and observe your surroundings. have some coffee, uh, three emergency blankets, some shades in a bag, emergency radio with a flashlight. I have a compass with a mirror on it. These are mainstay power bars. This basically feeds three people for a whole entire day. Have some extra pair of gloves in here. You gotta have make sure you have light. I have LED 180 lumens uh, big flashlight. You need to have DW40 when you when you're cutting firewood. It makes it a lot easier. You have a, like a little uh, uh, super absorbent towel here. You have a black trash bag. You never know this might come in handy trying to keep the water out. Then I have a solid fixation uh, fusion uh, Bowie type knife to cut wood. I also have another flashlight in here, LED. Have some wire, like I said, you never know when this might come in handy. And here I have a, I have a lot of miscellaneous items, um, gum, matches, tape, um, American flag. A uh, reflective belt, duct tape, pens, safety pins, batteries. I'll keep it on here for easy access. In here, this bag has a butane lighter. 
Also has some matches inside this protective pouch. Two lighters in case for emergencies. And what's in here is uh, these gel fuel by Pyrico. Um, it's safe, you, um, you know, and it lasts for 15 minutes each pouch. You never know when you might need fire. Also in here, I have a foldable stove. I have more ma more matches. This foldable stove is really neat. You unfold it, and you basically have a stove, and you put your your gel fuel in here with your pieces of wood. You got a little stove. With that stove, you never know when it might be raining out, so you should have um, some wood and and timber just in case you you can't find dry wood anywhere. So this is good to have. More gel fuel pouches. In here, I have some safety tie uh tie uh, zip ties. You never know when uh, this might come in handy. This is my toiletry. I got my spoon. I got some razor blades in there. In here is basically everything. Toothbrush, toothpaste, uh, Q-tips, towel, uh, cotton balls, uh, comb, some deodorant spray, chopstick, razor blade, uh, and soap. You never know. You want to try to stay clean and healthy while, while you're out there. I have some more. MREs in case. Here's a crowbar because you never know you might need to get into a building for protection or safety. Here's a tarp for uh, basically if you want to make shelter. This uh, tarp is really useful. And in here I have uh, 50 feet of uh, paracord 550 with five uh, stakes to you know to make the tent. This uh. This is very helpful when you're trying to stay out of the rain. And it's very important to have is um, a first aid kit. You never know in a, in, a, in a bad situation, there might be people that need uh, medical attention. So you basically have uh, gauze sponges. Um, I got in here medication. Uh, Coffee, uh, gauze swabs, band aids, burn gel, razor blade, alcohol, uh, tourniquet, five hour energy in case for emergencies. Um, basically, that's it. But you, you should always have a really good uh, emergency emergency kit ready, first aid kit. And in here, I got some more water, and that's pretty much it. Thank you very much.